This is in response to a comment left by WebSlinger2011. It says, can you include the wire switched on the BL Touch? Um, sure, I can do that. First, I want you to go here to the uh, anti clabs or BL Touch website. I'll leave a link below. And then just look at this diagram. What's important is actually the relationship of the wires in accordance to the uh, ground, Z minimum, uh, the signal, the ground, and volts. Just keep that in mind and use this as a reference. Uh, the relationship is going to be the same. Basically, you have a pin going here like this. Uh, it's going to correspond to the pin. So if you think about it, and going left to right, one, two, three, four, five, like that, you have a pin going in like this. So that's how you can tell, you know, you're going to be able to see like, okay, brown, red, yellow, and then black and white. So this black and white, I notice has to um, be switched. So you want to switch out the wires on the connectors that are um, not on the BL touch but on the opposite end of the BL touch those are going to be the connectors that you're going to be able to switch out much easier and I'm going to show you how to do that again just use this uh, diagram as a reference you have the black going to the ground the Z minimum going to the uh, white so this is going to be like the second third fourth fifth I'm pulling out the pins on the connector and sorry it's a little difficult to get it on camera right here I'm trying to show you the little uh, tab that was pressed in trying to get the connector out As you can see um, on the back, it's like, uh, if you think of it as an alligator's mouth, if that part opens up, um, the top part gets caught on the plastic. That's what prevents the actual pin from coming out of its housing. So you need to push that part in in order to get the wire out of the uh, connector housing. And once it's been pulled out, you need to open that mouth again before you put the before you put the pin into the housing. Otherwise, uh, you're going to have a problem of the wires slipping out of the housing. So if the mouth is open, uh, you'll hear a little snap when the actual uh, pin goes into the housing. I, I switched out the wires on the connector. As you can see, the little arrows that point down, or it's not arrows, they're actually little... Uh, tabs where the connector pushes in and then it's uh, and it snaps on so the pin socket actually has a direction that it needs to be pushed in on the back it's smooth and um, on the front it has like a tab which it inserts into the board so the white wire has to come toward the front of the printer and the black wire has to go to the rear of the printer. So you replace the LCD wire ribbon with the uh, pin 27 board and as you can see the pins match up so you can't make a mistake on it. The signal ground VCC clearly labeled. They are in line with the BL touch that you saw before at the start of the video. But just check with your own connectors to see if they all match up or line up. Insert the LCD signal cable. And here you can use a zip tie to tidy up the wires.
then you can actually put the bridge of the cover uh, you're gonna have to print that and you are gonna need two M320s and one M330 screws in order to put in this uh, cover So guys, this doesn't cover the entire BL Touch setup. I'm putting this up as an intermediary video because a user had a question. If you guys have any other questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Please subscribe, like, and share the video. Thanks.